We're going to be starting in about two minutes. So thank you for everyone that's on the line. We're going to be started in a few moments. So as you're coming on, make sure you mute your lines, please. So we're going to be starting in one minute. Thank you for everyone who's already on the line. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get started because we're going to be recording this anyway. So it is me, Makisha here, and I hope that each and last one of you are having a just a great evening so far. If you're not, after you get this good, good information, I know, I know you're going to live and having a good evening. So I just want to make sure that everyone can hear me. If you can hear me, just type a one one in the chat if you can hear me. I want to make sure before I continue, I'll get some one ones in the chat if you can hear me. All right, cool, cool, perfect, perfect. And as you're coming on the line, just make sure you mute your lines. So, like I said, we're going to get started. So, my name is Makisha, for those of you who don't know me, and I have been on this lovely journey of learning how to trade for the past three years. For the past three years, and I actually started getting serious about it for the past year. So, what brought me on this journey, just a little background about me, is because um, I used to be in the military. So I served 14 years in the military and I ended up being diagnosed with cancer. So I had to um, medically retire out of the military. And if you, any of you don't know how the military works, the money is good. Like the money is, is real good. I didn't have to worry about anything, not worry about anything medical, just not worry about anything at all. So when it was time for me to come off of orders because I had to start getting treatments and everything, I did not know what I was going to do as far as money wise. I wasn't. Sure, because I was accustomed to just this one paycheck. So I didn't know what I was going to do. So I started doing different things. I went into different network marketing things. And then over the past year, I came across back again was trading. Because I did it before, you know, a dabbled in it. Please. But make sure you mute your lines as you come on. So I dabbled in it before, but I really didn't have any success in it because I didn't have a particular let's say system to follow. I just going on there just watching random YouTube videos and I ended up failing. But last year I had someone come across and they was telling me the power of learning how to trade Forex. So I got into the system, started learning, um, going through the academy and started learning different things and start to see success. So I had an issue, which was I needed to make more money because I was so accustomed to just that one paycheck. So I don't know if anyone on the line, is anyone right now, have a where you just living on one paycheck or living paycheck to paycheck, comment three, three, is that you? Because we're being honest on the line tonight. That's what it's all about. I'm here to help you. And I'm gonna bring a special guest who's gonna help you as well. So go ahead. There we go, there we go, okay. Okay, there we are, there we are. Okay, all right. So I had to find out something how to create these multiple streams of income and that's why I came across Forex. So Forex has actually really saved my life in as far as income. So now I'm not just depending upon one thing, and especially with this coronavirus going on, right? Like people are panicking, people are buying tissue, bread, noodles. I went in the store, it was like no noodles. I wasn't looking for noodles, but the whole shelf was empty, right? And people are panicking. So some people have to be off work for like, 
Give me one moment. Make sure everyone their lines here. There we go. So some people happen to take off work for like two or three weeks, right? And you're wondering what is it that you're going to do? Because a lot of the stuff that's taken off two, three weeks, they aren't being paid for, which is crazy. So a lot of people are starting to panic. You see the stock market. I'm looking at this morning. A lot of stocks were just shooting down, right? And I had a friend of mine who was at the house. But all I saw was that they showed the stock markets on Bloomberg. They showed the Forex. You know what's happening on Forex? Forex is going up. And that's just the beauty of it. So I'm not really going to get into the details of what Forex is and difference between it because I have a special guest on the line. This special guest, you know how I talked about me being in the military? Because something about people in the military, I don't know if I'm being biased or not, you know, because I was in the military, but it's just a certain, like, a discipline, and you just seem to vibe more. So I came across this individual before I bring her on. I came across her, like, a couple of months ago. She was already doing Forex. I was already doing Forex. But when I met her, by her being a fellow veteran, I started to vibe with her more, right? And she wasn't really talking about just the, the money aspect of things. She's talking more of the spiritual side of it, right? On how to get that mindset right when it comes to making money. And she just broke it down to me. She became one of my favorite mentors. She just got back from London. She's been traveling all over the world. And she is just a phenomenal individual. And if anyone, anyone, if you're in her presence, she just fills you with so much joy and make you just want to keep pushing forward. So without further ado, change the screen and I want to bring Isis Love. I'm going to share my screen and use the line right quick. Hey, what's going on? What's going on? And peace and love, everybody. Peace and love. Hey, you guys, let's definitely give it back to my Keisha. Let's definitely drop some 11s in the chat bar for my Keisha, you guys, because she rocked the beginning of this call. But she has a powerful story, you guys. She definitely has a powerful story. She's out here in the Atlanta area um, and even outside of the Atlanta area really helping people come to the point where they're breaking the cycles of linear income. So definitely thank you so much, my Keisha, for having me on this call and being able to, you know, be a servant leader, you know, to our community. So thank you very much. Y'all drop some 11 11s down here from my Keisha. So you guys, let's just start into it. I mean, a little bit about me. Yes, I am ex-military. So shout out to all my people, you know, used to be in the military. And, um, you know, but growing up, I asked myself a question, you know, my parents were in the military and things, but I asked myself, you know, ISIS, how can you get your money to work for you versus you exchanging your time and energy for money? Because one thing's for sure, you guys, I, and maybe you guys can agree. And if you could agree, I want you to drop 22 in the chat bar. But how many of you guys have seen your parents growing up fight over money, have to work for money? never had time to spend time with you because making money and paying the bills and putting food on the table was the main priority. So that's how I grew up. And so um, two and a half years ago, you guys, I found myself homeless, um, living in my car and also living like in a, a shed. Back then I was embarrassed. I called it a tiny home, but now I'm humbly able to say it was a freaking shed. There's a little spot where I can sleep like a little bunk but it was a shed, right? And so I found myself back at that question. I felt like one of those vets that didn't have help and just didn't know where to go. And I found myself at that question, like ISIS, like how can you get your money to work for you versus you working for your money? You guys, cause I didn't want to work for anybody. You know, after, you know, just, I didn't work it, want to work for anybody. I didn't feel like working for somebody was really stable because they can let you go at any time. So um, that's a little bit about me, you guys. I've been doing this for two and a half years. Somebody brought this opportunity uh, to me. Of course, I didn't quite know what Forex was, but after they showed me the academy, one thing mm -hmm. for sure is that I believe in myself. Like that's one thing for sure. And all of you guys should believe in yourself because no matter what God you pray to, Buddha, the universe, Allah, Jesus, whatever, I just want you guys to know that that God did not bring you here to work 
work, work, struggle over money, struggle over money. So before we even get into, you know, Forex, what I want to do is I'm going to open your mind because there's something very important that I have to show you, right? And I don't know if you know it or not, but did you know that there were only four ways, four ways legally for you to make money in the whole wide world? Now we're talking about legally. We're not talking about all that crazy stuff on the side. We're talking about legally. Now, if you didn't know that and you're a parent or a grandparent or maybe you're a brother or a sister to somebody younger, I need you guys to write down what I'm about to share with you. Because here's a hard pill to swallow, but it's the truth. And I love to just lay out the truth. Um, if you do not teach them about financial literacy, who do you think is going to teach them? Because the school is not going to teach them. I mean, think about it. You didn't even get taught about financial literacy. So don't have your bloodline suffer in the financial ignorance of not knowing how money works. Okay, so let's check it out. I got my whiteboard. And I'm actually drawing something out and I'm going to show you, right? So the first way legally to make money, that's the E, by the way, is being an employee. Let's think about it. Majority of people make money from being an employee. So 60% to be precise of people work for somebody else. So when we think about employee, what do we think about? We think about a job. Think about it. Employees work at jobs, right? So... When you think about the word job, and I want you guys to write this down, write this down. I want you to study it because this is a wealth secret that I'm sharing with you. When you look at the word, um, when you look at the word job, the J stands for just. The, um, you know, the O stands for J O, over. And the B stands for broke. Your job gives you just enough money to survive, you guys. And some of us has been, been doing this for five 10 plus years just getting by you guys we have to do things different if we want to excel not only for ourselves but for our bloodline because a job cannot be passed down to your generation we cannot continue because let me ask you guys something i want you to come off mute because i want to feel the power behind your voice how many guys on the phone right now knows that you were meant for something bigger than your job just come off and say i, I do Isaiah does. I do. I, I do. do. I do. I do. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Let's go ahead and um, let's go ahead and mute the lines. But here's the thing: if you know that, why are you settling? If you know that you're destined to more than a job, then why are you settling just for the job? Why are you settling? Why are you settling for that relationship you don't want to be in? Why are you settling for that friend that never encourages you, but always disencourages you, right? Why, why are you with them, right? Here's the thing. Settle stands for seems more easier to think like an employee. It's more easier to be an employee than it is to be an entrepreneur. You need to stop settling. If you truly came off mute and meant what you truly said, then you need to honor your word and stop selling, settling. So check this out. People who are employees are exchanging time for money. Now, people always say, hey, if you make a lot of money, it's probably because you sold your soul for fame. No. Do you know that if you sell your time for money, that's like selling your soul? You guys, your time is your greatest asset. You cannot get your time back. It's golden. So you have to really pay attention to who is taking your time. Last but not least, you guys, somebody that controls your time controls your mind. When you're an employee, you guys, when somebody tells you when you can take vacation, when you can take lunch break, when you can take sick leave, that is somebody controlling your mind. And I want you guys to know, we're not down on jobs, but we're up on opportunities. So now that you get the picture of what an employee is, I want to take you to the second way to make money legally. The second way is self-employed. Now, does anybody know somebody that's self-employed? And if you do, come off mute and let me know what job they do. Anybody? Yeah, I have a contract negotiator. Healthcare. healthcare contract negotiator. Okay. I heard those two. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Somebody say something else. Yeah, a beautician. 
Got you. Okay, cool. That'll be enough. Thank you so much, you guys, for participating. Because I want you guys to know, this is not a presentation tonight. This is literally us having a conversation, you guys. My life purpose is to awaken the potential in each and every one in person, especially when it comes to the financial field. So I'm really just here sharing information. So thank you for speaking back. Now, I want you guys to know, self-employed is cool. 35% of people are self-employed. You don't have a boss, but guess what? Your job owns you. You have money, but you still don't have no time. Guess what? Because if you're a healthcare specialist, you have to, you're the only person in your field. If you are a contractor, you're the only person in your field. If you're a beautician, you got to do everybody's care. You can't be on the beach and making money because you have to be in the salon doing hair to make that money. So you have money, but no time. Remember, we're here today. Well, I'm going to write this down. We're here today to teach you how to get your time back. We're here today to teach you how to be a boss, to teach you how to be a boss of your life. Don't you want to be a boss of your life? Because here's the thing. We're all grown. Why do we got to act, especially if you're a grown man, and it's going to hit kind of hard for the men. It's going to hit kind of hard for the men. But y'all got y'all to gotta think about it, though. You really do. You a grown man. What you look like asking another grown man for some leave days off? You get what I'm saying? Like, I know it hurt, and I know it, like, it hit, but I'm here to keep it real with you. Even for the women, you a grown woman. Why you, you, you already got a dad. Why you going to ask some other man to do something? You get what I'm saying? So today is about keeping it real with yourself. This is Keep It Real Monday, right? Now, so today, we're, we're going to switch lanes, right? Today, whoops. So much of the hype, y'all. I'm so lit, right? So check this out. So today we want to show y'all how to move from the left side of money to the right side of money. Now we're going to teach you how to be a business owner, right? Now business owners make up 4% of the industry. A business owner is somebody like Tyler Perry, Oprah Winfrey, uh, Steve Jobs. These people can be on the beach and make money. Why? Because they have systems. You know what systems stand for? Write it down. You're going to miss it. System stays, stands for save yourself right? Time, energy, money. Save yourself time, energy, and money. Wealthy people know how important time are is, so they're not BSing around with their time. Guess what? Whoever, if you work at a bank right now, wherever you work at, your CEO and your CFO is not working. They got you working for them. You are building their empire. That's why it's important to build your own empire, because here's the thing. You're putting in all of those hours slaving barely for no raise to build something else for somebody else's family Ooh, i know it hit hard but it had to come out you're building an empire and generational wealth for somebody else's children not even your own that's something we got to sit and ponder on i don't care what job you got I don't care if they pay you overtime. Ain't no overtime in the world going to cover what type of time you're putting into building somebody else's legacy. Now, let's bring it down to the investor. We're here tonight to teach you how to be an investor. Only 1% of the world are investors. What is an investor? Let me tell you my typical morning. When I wake up in the morning, I don't wake up because of alarm clock. I don't wake up because alarm goes off and it says, ISIS, you got to be at work tomorrow. I wake up when I'm done sleeping. I wake up when I am done sleeping. How many of you guys, and I want to see it. Y'all put it in the comment bar. I, I got to make sure that I'm not by myself on this. How many of you guys would love to wake up when you are done sleeping? If that's you, I want you to comment 55 in the comment bar. If you would love, I don't even know if it is a comment bar on here, but if that's you, come off mute. And let me hear, I would. If you want to just wake up when you're done sleeping. I would. I would. Right? So I would, too. Uh, I would. I would. Be I would. Let's go. Let's go. Let's keep it real. Let's keep it real. Thank you. So that's the thing, you guys. 
That is what, and only 1% of people do that. Their money is making money for us. Too many, let me tell you, tonight is not one of these calls. This is the most unique call that you're ever going to be in in your whole life. Because I'm not teaching you how to, how to make money. Everybody teaches you, oh, you can sell this product or you can recruit this amount of people and make this amount of money. No, I am showing you today how to grow money. That's something out of this world nobody has ever sat down and taught you about. So definitely take heed at this next part I'm about to show you guys. So now that we get it, I want you to ask yourself, what side of money are you on? What side of money are you on? Are you on the left side or the right side? And why is it that 95% of people are on the left side of money and they give their money to the 5%? And why is it that the 5% control 95% of the money. What side of what side of money do you want to be on? It's your choice, right? So now that you get the now that you get the importance on why you need to learn forex and why you need to learn how to be a business owner, I hope that sunk in. I want to tell you guys really quick five to six differences between forex and stocks before I show you the financial uh, education. If that's okay with you guys, just come off mute and say uh that's okay. That's okay. That's all right. Okay. That's okay with me. It's okay with me too. Let's go. Let's go. I just want to make sure that I'm not boring you guys because I know sometimes money can be boring for, for you guys. And I really want to break this down so thorough that it makes a lot of sense for you guys because I know finances can be one of those complicated things, but it's really not, right? So stocks deals with companies, you guys. So when you think about stocks, you think about Tesla, you think about uh, Walmart, you think about AT&T, that's company, company base. Now, Forex deals with currency. So if all of us was to travel to Mexico right now, we would take our American money, we would get to the foreign exchange in the airport, we would give the people the American money, they will give us back uh, pesos, and depending on the value, we're either going to be living a vida loca in Mexico, balling, because the American dollar is stronger, or we're going to be breaking even. But in this instance, you guys, nine times out of 10, the American dollar is still stronger than peso. So that's kind of what Forex is. It's the exchange of currencies all throughout the world. Thailand, Germany, Italy, different places, you guys. Now, the stock market is only a 26.6 billion dollar a day uh, market. Now, some of you guys know this freaking coronavirus thing is hitting. If you're just depending on stocks, you probably lost a lot of your money because the US dollar is crashing. It's literally crashing right before your eyes. Now, if you're a Forex trader, right, which the Forex market is a $7.7 .7 trillion a day market, you will be capitalizing on the fall. Instead of panicking, worried about Lysol, hand sanitizer, and masks, you will be at home behind your computer being quarantined, making money in the quarantine. Instead of focusing on, oh my gosh, what's going on? You guys, when you know how money works, you get the insider secrets. See, a lot of people think, Oh, people who have money, they must be an Illuminati and all of this stuff. Now I see that used to be me. That used to be me. I used to be that person. But now that I know the wealth secrets and now that I know how the wealthy move, I know it's just about being ahead of the game. This is a game. Do you want to be in the game or do you want to get played? Right? Your choice. So with that being said, you guys, there are 12 zeros in a trillion. I don't know if you knew that or not, but there's 12 zeros in a trillion, right? So these are my notes. Uh, I write like a doctor. I'm glad I don't know how to, I don't need to know how to write neat to make money, right? So check this out. Now the stock market is only open Monday through Friday and it's only open um, from nine to five. So here's the thing. If you get off work after five, you can't profit off the stock market. You're being limited. Well, see, with Forex, you can make money 24-7, 24-7, Monday through Monday, any time of the night. You can get off at 12 o'clock in the night, pull your cell phone up, look at the charts and make money, right? This is what I like. I don't like no limits to my money because I'm on a limited being. And all of you guys are unlimited, so why shouldn't you have access to an unlimited amount of money? Y'all follow me? So check this out, you guys. Now, two more things just to follow up with you guys. Now, the stock market is not recession proof. Right now, we are going through a recession. That's what it really is. We are going through a recession. The housing market, the stock market is crashing. Now, remember, I told you, with Forex, 
it is recession proof. Remember, we're, we're capitalizing off of this recession. That's something so very key because if you're looking for daily money, Forex is where it's at. With stocks, you only get between 12 to 15% ROI, which is return on investment a year. I would rather make money daily so that you can leave your job versus just relying on stocks, right? Now, last but not least, with stocks, you only can make money when the market goes up. Meaning if you buy Tesla at 100, Tesla goes up 100, you made a $100 profit. If you got stocks, you're make, if you're doing Forex, you're making money when the market goes up and the market's going down, you guys. I hope that has brought you some value on what the difference is between stocks and Forex. Now we're about to get into the nitty gritty. We're about to get into the moment y'all been waiting for. Now that I got your mind all juiced up, let's get into it, you guys. So I'm going to share my screen. Hopefully I got the ability to share the screen. Yes. Let me know um, uh, if you can. You guys see my screen right now? Yep, I see it. Yes. Let's rock and roll. We're in the money now. Check this out, you guys. This app is called. This app is called. I need everybody to download it right now too. Uh, this app is called MetaTrader Four. MetaTrader Four. Now, this you probably seen in the airport where you see all of the different currencies. This is this it right now. So it's so simple. This is for the average person who think that they don't have time, even though they do have time. I want, the, I want you guys to know that you still can make money while you're learning. I need you really to pay attention to this part because this can fly over some of your heads because it sounds so simple. You might not even believe it, but it is. Now check this out. Imagine... Um, somebody that's making six to seven figures already trading. They are doing the work for you and giving you the answers. Let me show you what I mean. So this group right here is our signal group. So some of our traders, we're already doing the work. Like this came from some of the seven figure traders. The only thing you have to do is copy and paste the numbers into the cell phone app. Let me show you real quick. So here's another app called Swipe Coin. So whenever the alert comes on your cell phone, it's just like Tinder. You know on Tinder how you can swipe if you wanna to talk to the person, swipe if you don't. Now I want you guys to know, I don't have that app. I just heard about it, right? So check this out. You go here, and the only thing I'll need to do is find this pair, XRP USD. Now your kids can do this. I want you guys to follow along with me. Your kids can do this. They're on the phone always. There it goes, XRP USD. I'll open it up. They come back over here. They tell me that the take profit is, you see where it says take profit number one? I hold it down, copy. I come over here to this app, paste. Okay, I go back to the app because I got to put one more number in. Right? It says stop loss. Now, my stop loss is my safety net. So if the trade doesn't go in my favor, I don't have to worry about all of my money being gone. So, for example, if I say, hey, I'm going to, I'm betting to make three thirty dollars on this trade, but if this trade doesn't go in my favor, I only want to risk five dollars. That means if it doesn't go in your favor, it's only going to be a negative. Uh, it's either going to be a negative five dollars or a positive thirty. That's why I love the stop loss, and they're giving you this answer. So even if you don't know what these terminologies are. It doesn't matter. We're going to at least, you're going to at least know how to place a trade, what I'm doing right now, right? So we go back and what does it tell us? It tells us it's a sale, sale by market. Only thing, and I'm not going to do it because this was three hours ago and the money move already made it. I'm just showing you as an example. So the only thing that I would have to do is come and hit sale. Now, let me ask y'all something. That took me, I kind of explained it to y'all, so it took a little longer. But if you were in a grocery store and this alert popped up on your cell phone, how long do you think, even if you didn't know how to trade Forex right yet, you're still learning, how long do you think it would take you to copy and paste that and put that in the app? Somebody come off mute and let me know. Two minutes. Anybody else? Yeah. Not long at all. It. Yep. Two six. So, yes, yes. So this is what I want you guys to know. You, I want you to really pay attention when I show you this academy because it doesn't matter what you're doing right now. 
you have enough time to do that. You guys, you have the opportunity to get money from these traders. Now, let me show you these traders. Let me go ahead and log on to the academy. You guys still can see my um, my phone, right? Everybody still can see my screen? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Amazing, amazing. You guys, this is phenomenal. Never in life has there been a platform where basically it's like, imagine if you want a six pack, right? Shout out to all my gym junkies. I love to go to the gym. So shout out to all my people that go to the gym. But let's just suppose you don't like to go to the gym, but you still want the six pack abs. So imagine one of us who love to go to the gym. We went to the gym for you and we got the six pack for you and you didn't have to do the work. That's basically what I'm inviting you to do. I'm inviting you to have an opportunity to basically copy people who have the credibility in trading to still make money, you guys. Now, whenever you become a member with our academy, yes, you do have to become a member. This is a private school, private online school, and we'll talk about how to do that. I have about 15 more minutes on this call, so just bear with me, right? So what you're going to do is you're going to go to academies. Now, it doesn't matter if you don't know how to do this, right? Because here's the thing. We're going to show you, right? No need to research anything because here's the thing, you guys. When you research about uh, Forex, it's going to give you the facts. Just like if you research how to become a doctor, you're going to get some facts, but you're not going to get the curriculum. So this is the curriculum. I always tell people there's five deadly excuses that people make. And the first excuse is after they see this, they feel like they have to do research, but it's really just fear. So I'm here to help you, let you know that the only thing that we really literally should be researching is our bank account. Like if you really want to research something, you should actually go back from the many years that passed and figure out why your bank account hasn't expanded. Like, if we want to research something, that's what we should research. That should puzzle you on why you're doing all of this work day in and day out, but your bank account hasn't changed, right? Now, we have different languages because we're in different countries. We're in different states. And so we're going to go to English. Now, I want you guys to come off mute and keep it real with me. How many of you guys spend, now write this word down, S-P-E-N-D, take off the S and P. When you take off the S and the P, that word is in. Whatever you spend time on, your time is just done. It's not producing anything. So how many of you guys spend, honestly, 30 minutes to an hour on social media? Come off mute, keep it real with me. I spend about <clears throat> three hours on social media. And who was that speaking? This is Arthur D. and Miller. Thank you, Miss Arthur D, for sharing mail. Anybody else? I spend a lot of time. I don't know how much, but a lot. And who will be speaking with? This is Lakeisha. What's going on, Lakeisha? Thank you for joining. So thank y'all, thank y'all for sharing. So deadly number excuse number two. I don't have any time, Isis. My schedule is full. I'm a single mother. I got five kids. I've got two or three jobs, excuses, right? Now, I have to say that these things are not true, but some of you who did and didn't answer just honestly said that you spend time on doing non-producing activities. Those activities don't bring you the money that you want to cut down on the second jobs, to help you if you're a single mother. You get what I'm saying? So needless to say, you have the time. You know why? Because these videos range between two minutes all the way up to I think 15 minutes this video right here I'm not going to play it because you're not going to be able to hear it but you can see the quality of the video this is no YouTube sit behind the screen videos these videos this company is a billion dollar company a billion dollar school so you know we're going to have high quality definition um for you guys to see this so this academy you can't see the time on here um but it's all oh, there though it's only two minutes and 24 seconds. So you could be on the toilet and you can have this plan with a notebook, learn it. You could be in the shower listening to this. This You could be in the car. You could be preparing uh, food for your kids and watching this. So needless to say, you do have time, right? So um, this whole basic academy is only two hours and 30 minutes. 
which is broken down into about 30 videos. And you can just kind of see how crisp and clean the uh, videos are. And he's basically going to break down what Forex is more visual. So, you know, just like school, when you first got to school, some of the subjects may not make sense. But the more you continue to get the lessons and the homework, it made sense, right? And you took good notes. It's the same thing, you guys. I don't want you to, to think it's any different. So right after that, you have a test. This test is not going to be graded by a professor. You can fail as many times as you want. But what this test does is give you the confidence. Because a lot of people want to rush through here and they want to get to the money fast. But this is how we know if you really know what you're talking about by just taking a simple test, you guys. So really, this academy is phenomenal because you can't get this on YouTube. You just can't because if you don't know how Forex works, but you want to, you heard my Keisha said when she was on YouTube, she had no mentor. She had no structure. She had no foundation. She didn't know where to start. But as soon as she got into our school, she had, she had all of that. So now that you see, you know, when you're joining our academy, you're getting the basic, the advanced and the intermediate knowledge. Also, you're also learning about cryptocurrency. If you want to learn about that too. Now, I got two more things to show you, and I'll teach you guys how you can get into this. Now, I want you guys to keep it real with me again, and I'm going to keep it real with you, too. Now, when I have time, hints on the word, when I have time, you guys, I love to watch me some Hulu or some Netflix. You know, when I have time and I'm not doing anything and I did all of my goals and I made my money for the day, uh, you know, maybe once or twice out of seven days, I may watch something right? And so when I do, I like to watch The Walking Dead. Like, the new season just came out. I'm like, I missed like four or five season, I mean episodes because i just been so focused. Now, I want you guys to share with me, like, what is your favorite show that you watch? Also, The Walking Dead. <laughs> okay, that's, that's what's up. Walking Dead lover, who else? I like Law and Order. Okay, okay. Anybody else? How to get away with murder. <laughs> Ooh, that one right there. We got like a watch out now. Yes. What else? What else? What else? All American. One more. All American. Let's go. Let's go. So check this out, family. Now, this is going to be a hard pill to swallow. But remember, I'm about keeping it real, being transparent. And here's the thing. We cannot be entertained and broke. I mean, like, really think about it. Like, we cannot be... And on the couch, spending, there goes that word again, so much time invested in watching TV when the TV is not going to stop our, our, our bank account from looking like gas prices. Because here's the thing, Rick on The Walking Dead, I don't know his real name, but Rick, he got royalties for his family. The more and more Walking Dead is played every day by people like us, his family is getting paid. So once again, Somebody that controls your time controls your mind. So when we're giving all of, I'm not saying don't do it. I just told you I did it. But my goals come first. My securing my last name comes first. Being the CEO of my last name comes first. Entertainment comes second. I can kiki and laugh, laugh when I'm at the bank in the beach, right? Y'all following me? If y'all following me, just come off mute. I want to make sure that last one makes sense. Come off mute and let me know if y'all following me. We follow. Following. I'm following right. you. I'm following right. as well. Let's go. Let's go. I'm only here to keep it real with y'all. So check this out. Now, when you shift that time that you spend watching that, you guys, you can invest in your time to watch our TV. Now, these are different educators from different nationalities, backgrounds, and creeds. Um, this is just some of the top educators that you see right here. There's like, look, there's 51K people viewing her every day. There's 91K, 91K people viewing this person every day. You guys, if this was not working, do you think that this many people would tune in daily? If something's not working, ain't nobody going to tune in. This person right here has 116K people watching him daily. I want y'all to really understand what I'm saying to you. We are winning. Not to toot our own horn, you guys, but there's no other financial platform of Forex that's going to give it to you at an affordable rate with the quality that we have. Now, 
remember, I told you it's different. Now, this is kind of like your TV guy for you guys who have cable. You can go see what time the basketball game's coming on, the football game, the baseball game, the uh, the law and order, power, how to murder people and, and not get caught or whatever, all of those different things, right? So I want you to be able to tune in to this TV that's going to change your bank account. Look at him. He come on Monday through Friday, 2 in the morning. Maybe that's too early for you. No problem. You got him Monday through Friday, 12 in the morning. Maybe that's too early for you. You got him 8 in the morning, morning through Friday. You get the point, you guys. You have these different educators that you can tune in on different days to get the sauce. Now, remember I told you, you have the opportunity to watch them. They do the work but you put the answers in your cell phone. You cannot tell me, nobody should even have to think about this. I mean, literally after this presentation or, or, or what you wanna say, AKA conversation, everybody should sign up for this. Why? Because even if you don't know how to do this yet, you guys, you literally have the opportunity to sit on the webinar, not sit and watch Walking Dead, but sit on this webinar and they telling you the answers. Like, really listen to me and what I'm telling you right now. Don't let fear say that you can't do this. You can do anything that you put your mind thing to. You know what they say in the Bible, and I'm not a religious person, but one thing for sure, I am a spiritual person. But all things that they believe in is possible. You can do this. You can do this, right? So I'm going to show you a little bit of this webinar Basically, you're not going to be able to hear it, but you'll be able to see how crisp, how clear. This ain't no YouTube type of videos. You know, these are professional videos. And so you get to sit on this session with him. As he's basically says class is about to begin, everybody starts their, their, uh, theirs off different. Some people do mindset videos. Some people have music in the back. It just depends. And you pick who you want to vibe with. So basically, you'll be going through this session with you, and he's going to be teaching you, you guys, just like if you want to be a piano player. If you want to be a piano player, you would sit with the, the, the pianoist, and they would teach you how to play the piano. There's no difference. There's no difference. There's not math. This is not math. You don't need to know math. All you need to do is have a calculator and be able to add and subtract. Tell your ego to shut up right now. Because some of you guys are listening to me and you're listening to your ego. And that's disrespectful. So tell your ego it's not about math. We're, you know what I'm saying? So you have time for this. You don't need to research this. You can do this, right? This is possible for you, right? And um, it's no different from learning a subject. So check this out, you guys. Just in case you can't watch it live, you got all the recorded sessions right here. Um, guess what? Uh, favorite sessions are right there. If you see all these people in here talking, um, this person said me, Columbia. This person's in Columbia. Uh, this person's in New York. This person's in Ohio. This person's in Chicago, Ca Canada. Uh, let's see if anybody else is saying anything else. Uh, uh, um, Cali. So remember, these are people all over the world tuning in to this live education, learning how to get their money to work for them versus them working for their money, you guys. So pretty much, I got one more thing to show you, and that's going to uh, fill it up, you guys, because I don't want to overcook the grits. Like I said, it's a no-brainer. If you're working for your money right now and you don't know how to get your money to work for you, this is the solution. Forex is the solution. We're helping you guys retire in 52 weeks versus 40 years. And here's the thing. You guys are used to paying for college, right? Like if you're used to, if you're used to paying for college, I want to come off mute and say college. 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 So. College. There you go. So here you go. You're used to paying for college, you guys. And this is the only thing, like, and then guess what? You don't have to sell and recruit. Like, I don't need people to make this money. I don't need people, if I knew how to play the piano, I don't need somebody to join, to join, to learn how to play piano, to make money at a pop-up shop. I don't need you guys to make money. I can get off this phone right now and I have tools and technology that's going to show me how to make the money with or without you. But I'm inviting you 
to make money with us. I'm inviting you to not just keep watching these people's timeline on Instagram and, and things and be in the timeline. Don't watch the timeline and watch the Instagram stories. Be in the Instagram stories with us, right? So this right here, you guys, is 87% accurate. It's called our harmonic scanner. You get this free with your membership, which we're gonna talk in about three minutes. Just give me three minutes, you guys. So what this means is, I don't know about you guys, but my whole high school career, <laughs> not career, but my whole high school time, right? I said career, literally was nothing from a career, right? But like, I did some work on my own, but I copied a lot, you guys. I cheat off tests, I cheat off homework. So if that was you, you had the opportunity to do the same thing. So if you look over here to my right, do you guys see where it says TP1, TP2, TP3? Anybody see TP1, TP2, TP3? Yes. Amazing, amazing. And you guys see these candles. The candles are these red and blue things. So if you look at these red and blue things, AKA, candles can and if you look at the take profit tp1 tp2 you'll see the tp1 tp2 has these little small blue like tick marks can you guys honestly say that that this market has hit all three of the tps like one two and three like they pass through those tick marks can you guys see that can y'all see yes that? yes Okay, so look, yes, it went through these little points. So what that means is just like that app I showed you, remember how I showed you, all I gotta do is hold this button down and put it in this app. Now this one's a little different. You All you have to do is manually put the numbers in there. It's the same thing. It's telling you when to get in. It's telling you if it's a buy or a sell. And it's telling you, look, it's telling you there goes the stop up there. And there goes that stop number. And there goes those TP numbers. So if you can see it, you guys, this, this trade has took profit. It already took profit. So if you would have got in at the beginning where it says D, right there at D, you could have rolled it down with little to no knowledge. Now let's talk about how much money you could have got from this. Let's talk about that really quick, really quick. Let's talk about how much money. And what I'm about to do is measure money. So I'll get my ruler. Remember, I told you this is not hardcore math, right? I'm gonna get my ruler. Let me see if I can do it with my finger. And let's measure, let's measure how far it's, it's going down. Give me one second, because I normally don't do this on my cell phone. Oh, yeah, by the way, it's all about personal preference. You can do this on your cell. You can do this on, um, you can do this on your computer. It's all up to you. Okay, about 201. So this went down, all the way down to here, down to the bottom, it, it went down 201 points. Let me put this into per, uh, perspective for you. So imagine you came in with 10 cents on the market. You fund your account with $100. So let's just face it, everybody got about $100, right? And you took 10 cents from that $100 times the 201. You would have made $20 on that trade, right? And it would have took you um, two days. So in two days, you could have took 10 cents and made $20. Now, some of you guys are probably saying $20, that's it. But here's the thing. If you was missing $20 from your job check, you'll be on the phone with HR so fast trying to see what happened, why. You get what I'm saying? And you got to think about what I just said. You took 10 freaking cent. If you're not a Forex trader, all of you guys have 20, 10 cent right now. But guess what? Put, tw put your 10 cent on your dresser drawer, and I bet you in two days it's either going to be lost or still going to be there. Right now, let's talk bigger numbers. Let's say we did five dollars times two hundred one. That's a thousand dollars. So I'm telling you that you could have fund your account with about maybe five hundred dollars if you're going to be using bigger numbers. Let's just say you funded your account with three hundred to five hundred dollars, and from that three to five hundred dollars, you took five dollars from it. You use the harmonic scanner, even though you don't know how to trade. You know how to copy and paste, and with the two dollars, you turn that five dollars to a thousand. How many of you guys make a thousand dollars every two take two days at your job? I got a less response because you don't. Because remember, nobody has ever taught you how to grow your money. What I just showed you is how to grow money, not work, right? So you guys, 
that's pretty much how it works. Before I end this call, let me uh let me uh come back to you guys. Let me show you how to get in this. Like I said, I don't need to overcook the grits because it is what it is. Um, my Keisha, are you there? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. So check this out, my Keisha. If um, what is what's what's your favorite type of car? And we're almost done, you guys. Mm, I love me an Audi R8. Okay, what color is the inside and outside? Mm, the outside is is black. Inside, all red. Okay, black and red. So check this out really quick. So if I hit it big on trading, I want you guys to listen, listen. We got two minutes. Just listen to me. If I hit it big on trading and I came to your house and I said, look, my Keisha, I said, look, I got this R8 Audi black on red for you. I'm going to give it to you, but I want to make sure you're serious. I'm going to give it to you, but I need $250, but I need it in the next four hours and I'll give you this car. If you didn't have the money, would you get the money to be able to get the car? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm going to do what I got to do, and I'm, I'm going to get that, yeah. yeah. You're going to definitely get the money. So even if you got to take something to the pawn shop. Hey, I got to do what I got to do for my car, so yeah. <laughs> I feel you. Now, if anybody would do the same thing for their car, dream car, I want you to come off mute and say, I would. I would. It's a dream car. I would. I would. I would. I definitely would. Amazing. So check this out. My Keisha, is a car a liability or an asset? That's a liability as a car. Now, is your financial education a liability or an asset? Oh, that's an asset. That's an asset. Now check this out. Now, some this is where we're going to find out who's lying. Now, some of you guys just said, I would just to agree. Just to, and I thank you for being cooperative, right? But we're going to see who really lying. We're also going to see wealthy mindset versus poor mindset now this now you just said now remember you just said for the car if you didn't have the money you would go get it now this education is only 235 dollars that's 15 dollars cheaper than what you would have to get for the car now why do i say some people is lying because some of you guys want to do this but you're going to say you don't have the money why can't you take in the next four hours to do the same work you would do to, for the car to do it for the financial education. See, wealth is a mindset. It's not about how you make, it's about how your mind works. So poor mindset <clears throat> automatically said, oh man, I don't have the money. But you just said you'll do it for the car. Poor mindset said, oh my gosh, I can't do this. I'm going to be at work tomorrow. But wealthy mindset said, hmm, now if I can do it for a car, why couldn't I do it for this? If I can cut back on my cable because law and order is not paying me, why couldn't I do this? If I can borrow $20 from my cousin, borrow another 20 from that person, I will only have to add that amount. Why couldn't I do this? Those are the type of people that I'm interested in working with. People who really want it, and that's going to do, you guys, I didn't even have internet. I had to pull up at Starbucks. I had to stay at Panera Bread. I had to pull up at Walmart. When I was sleeping in Walmart parking lot, I had to pull up to the garden center just to be able to use Walmart's Wi-Fi to get this education. I wanted it bad. I was in a slump. You know what a slump stands for? I got it on my whiteboard. A slump stands for skeptical, laziness, undecided, misdirected and poor attitude right now you're in a slump because one of the following and you need to get out of it so i encourage you guys to go get the money because we all have it we spend it on going out to eat we spend it on our cell phones some of you guys are paying a monthly pan just to keep up with the joneses to have the new iphone and the new samsung and y'all know i'm keeping it real right so it's 235 to join in that's one time fee right and then to uphold your membership, just like every month, if you want to keep talking to your boo on your cell phone, if you want to keep using the internet at your house, what you got to do, you got to pay a monthly fee because you want to keep using it. So if you want to continue to get learning for $5.85 a day, $5.85 a day, y'all spent that on going out to eat today. Some of y'all say spend that on a pack of cigarettes or Starbucks coffee. I just showed you how you can make $20 in two days. So if the membership is $5.85 a day, 
why couldn't you pay for it? Times that by 30 days, that's $175, you guys. That's nothing. When you break it up like that, that's nothing. So 30 days from the day you sign up is when your tuition kicks in. You don't pay tuition when you first join. You only pay the sign-up fee for $235. 30 days from that is when you pay your tuition. Now, here's the thing. We also have a scholarship program. Now, if you know some friends, some buddies, some partners, some coworkers, some people that are getting tired of working, some people who are suffering from the coronavirus and they don't know what to do, all you have to do is tomorrow at seven o'clock, if they're in Atlanta, we're having an event in Atlanta, we're gonna share, we can share it with them there, or we'll also have another cyber event tomorrow at seven. Get them on the call because if they like this, they're going to join with your sign-up link because you get your own private link, and that will waive your tuition. You don't have to worry about getting two people right now. Maybe you're like, look, I don't care. I'm going to pay the tuition. When the two people come, they come. That's cool, too. But I do want you guys to know that a scholarship program is there. Now, in closing, there's three types of people on here. Now, the A type of person is ready to get started. They literally want to change. They want something new. They want to be able to leave their job. Because here's the thing, we all want money and we, we all want to leave our job, but who has the guts to do it? Which one of you guys are not letting fear stop you today from joining this opportunity? If you're that A type of person, the person after this call is going to hit you up. They're going to see how you like this and they're going to answer your questions. If you're A, let them know you're A. Remember, you can get the money because you can get it for a car. Now, the B type of person is, but I have questions. If you have questions, get with the person that invited you. Hop on the phone with them and get your questions answered. Or B could be, but I'm broke. But remember, you're not broke. You can get the money in four hours. We can make it happen, right? Now, the C type of person is, hey, I see y'all at work tomorrow. I would rather continue to exchange my time and energy for money. And if that's you, you guys, I'll see you. I won't see you at work tomorrow, but you have a good day at work tomorrow. I hope I at least gave you some value. Um, but just know that by you doing that, you're being selfish because you're not thinking about your generation. You're just thinking about you. You're just being comfortable with the money that you're, they're giving you at your job, but you're not thinking about your grandkids. You're not thinking about your grandkids' grandkids. What about them? Do you want them to struggle like how you're struggling? Do you want them to leave paycheck to paycheck? This is bigger than you guys. So thank you so much for joining this call. I will catch you guys at the beaches and the banks all around the world. And one more thing, I want you guys to add me on Instagram. Really quick, you guys, add me on Instagram. Follow the journey. I want you guys to check the resume because we're changing people's lives. It's Isis underscore love 511. Isis, I-S-I-S underscore 511. I'm going to give it back to my Keisha, but you guys, thank you so much for joining this call. Peace and love. I want to say thank you so much, Isis. I want everyone to unmute your lines and just say, hey, how awesome of a job she did. Just say, yeah, she did a good job. Say, unmute your lines and say, yeah, if you think that she shared some phenomenal information tonight. She's, yeah. Yeah. That was fire, yeah. Isis. Great job. Great job. <laughs> there we go. So, as you know, I don't know if anyone was anyone if anyone can show me that like, I was taking notes. I mean, I pretty much, you know, noticed the information, but I was taking notes. But she shared some powerful stuff about and she was doing this stuff from her cell phone. So I just want to say first, she was doing this from her cell phone. So a lot of us that are watching this right now is from my cell phone. So a lot of people say, Oh, I can't start until I get a laptop, I can't start to get a computer. You're doing it from a cell phone. We I'm recording this from a cell phone. So a lot of this stuff is not hard, it's just new. And I don't know if you're like me, I like a personal walkthrough. So like she said, if you're here in Atlanta, tomorrow at 7 p.m., we're gonna be doing a live event. So make sure you either contact myself or Isis herself and we will get your information to get you on the, the list because we only have a few more seats available. So that is all for today. I wanna to say thank you so much for tuning in and we will see you all, for those of you here in Atlanta, see you tomorrow. For the rest of you all, we'll see you, like you said, at the beaches and at the bank. Have a wonderful and blessed evening.